Um, it was kind of a quick process. Basically, um, the head coach, she called me like two weeks before our semi-state and uh, she went to every like semi-state and state and then I went on my official and then I committed after the weekend. So, yep. How the heck did she see you play? Um, from she saw my AU coach, she got in contact with her, and it kind of rolled down the hill from there. So, okay. Yeah. So describe when you went on your official visit. What was that like? Oh, it was awesome. Um, I got on campus and I met with the um, you know weight and strength who you know I'll be spending a lot of time with, especially this summer and um, in the fall and then uh, after season. And I met with the coaches and then I spent the night with the girls and um, it was so much fun and. Um, it's going to be like a family, I can tell already, so I'm super excited. Yeah. Now, what other schools were you thinking about uh, going to? Um, basically, Air Force and uh, Florida Southern. So, yep. Nothing in Fort Wayne. No, no, yeah. <laughs> Nervous about that? Um, not really. I mean, um, I'm kind of independent, and um, I'm not, not really worried about it, like, distance at all. I have family out there, so, yeah. Oh, well, and that then, always helps. Yeah. you got a family out yeah, there. Yeah. Um, do they play anyone around this area? Um, no, they're the, in the American East, so basically, um, like strictly East Coast. They may play some like um, like preseason games um, out here. The schedule's not really released yet, but um, like they played Notre Dame last year at Notre Dame. So um, I don't know if we'll have any like that, but okay. yeah. Now, when people move on to the next level, sometimes they switch the positions they play. So mm -hmm. where do you expect yourself to fit in with the? What are they? The River Hawks. The River Hawks. Yep. Where do you yep. fit in with the River Hawks? Um, I'll probably, I mean, I mean, being 6'2", I'll probably stay at um, a post position, but um, she may, she likes my shooting, so um, she may bring me out to like a 4 or 3, so um, I guess we'll just have to see how I progress and how I fit in with the team, and um, she'll make that decision, so. Now, when you started playing basketball here at Canterbury, was this a long-term goal of yours? Um, I always wanted to play at the next level, and um, you know I've I've always had my goal set high. Whether um, like college was the ultimate goal, but you know D1 would be like the perfect thing. And now that I'm here, and you know I have all my workouts, it's kind of setting in, and um, you know it's going to be hard, but I'm I'm so excited and ready for the challenge. So yeah, does it feel a little different now that it's officially on paper? Um, a little bit. It's, um, especially like this week is crazy. Like we have gradu I'm graduating this Friday, and everything's moving so fast. I'm moving in like next month. So um, maybe not right now, but I'm sure, you know, when I'm getting ready, getting all my stuff ready and um, finalizing everything here at Canterbury, it'll kind of sit in for me. So, yeah. What have you thought about studying? Um, right now I'm leaning towards double majoring in political science and economics and then minoring in Spanish and possibly philosophy. So.